faces, everybody! Okay, ready for rehearsal. Remember, I want to see lots of happy faces. In this special edition of Kratz Creatures, my brother Martin and I will take you behind the scenes of our show. It wasn't always easy, and there were lots of surprises. But when you're creature adventuring, one thing is for sure. Expect the unexpected. Uh-oh. <laughs> Man, that was close. Chris, we're the dog! One thing you have to remember when you're filming is that when you're in another creature's territory, he's the one who calls the shots. You know, Martin, we've really made some sacrifices trying to fit in around the creature world. I know. Sometimes I wonder if this is the best way. I don't know, but it's exciting. Hey, Mark, are these zebras buying this? I don't know, they look pretty suspicious. Hey, Chris, do something zebra-like. Okay, how was that? Hey. <laughs> but believe it or not, we always have a point that we're trying to make. Even if making it means dressing up in some pretty funky duds. <laughs> or trying out our acting skills. <laughs> Old Stinky! He's really outdone himself this time. <laughs> oh, Stinky, this was a good one. <laughs> well, it's not exactly masterpiece theater, but it does recreate how the platypus was discovered. Hey, Martin, remember the time you did that stint as a creature sportscaster? Oh, yeah. It's not like you're appointed for life. You just... <laughs> oh, gosh. Okay, let me start again. Are ready? Sometimes we had problems with our props and equipment. Whoa, there it goes. <laughs> That's it. Brother, do an experiment on you. <laughs> what are you doing? Run! Some oh! things got pretty painful, Mark, especially when you tried to go as fast as a cheetah. You're picking up speed. Keep pumping. Woo Come on, bro. The wind's right. I remember one particularly painful day. But the member of the Creature Club who got the most lumps, bumps, and bruises was definitely Ken, the hippo test dummy. When things got a little too dangerous for us, that's when we called in Ken. You ready, buddy? Good luck, Ken! Oh no, Ken's toast. Hey, 
Let's see if Ken can fly. T minus five and count. Four, three, two, one. Whoa! Let's try another way. can learn, there's one thing that Ken definitely found out. He found out that you have to treat creatures with respect and give them their space. Because if they feel threatened, <laughs> well, enough said. Yeah, Ken was always ready when duty called. And the call of the wild took us on some great safaris. Yeah, like surfing safaris to find sea turtles. Exactly the best surfers, but we did find sea turtles. And that's the whole point of our creature mission. <laughs> yeah! And then they blow it all over themselves. <laughs> <laughs> and they can disappear in every little nook and cranny. Excuse me. You have a hand for it, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's for sure. <laughs> Perfect. Which is a lot like when mom taught us how to use <laughs> Wait a second. Their background. <laughs> <laughs> Who's driving? <laughs> you know, there's nothing like creature adventure. Yeah. Hey, so what was your favorite adventure, Mark? Oh, that's tough. Maybe hanging out with baboons. What about swimming with the manatees? Or roaming around with giraffes? Well, one thing's for sure. There's something funny, fascinating, and bizarre about every creature. And we still have so many to meet. The creature mission continues. <laughs> so where to next, Chris? Tigers in India? Yeah, and on the way we can stop and visit the Komodo dragons. Great, and we can't forget about orangutans. Or the clouded leopards. Or the binturongs. Or the sun bears. Or the gibbons. Or the flying lemurs. <laughs>